hello and welcome uh, to this new video in today's video we are going to see how to convert a VMware uh, virtual disk uh, which has multiple files which is split into multiple files how to convert it to a single file so if you if you used a VMware workstation like, like I did which I'm using now when you create a new virtual machine you have the choice when creating creating the virtual disk to make it one single file or multiple split files and sometimes we use uh, like multiple split files because it is easy to copy and move when needed but the problem is that this option it can slow uh, the VM performance especially if uh, your virtual disk is on a uh, hard disk like not a necessity uh, fast disk okay so in my situation I have a virtual machine this uh, CentOS 7 Oracle machine which is dedicated to Oracle database and it has its its uh, virtual disk has multiple split files as you can see here so the disk is 130 gigabytes and it has like 33 split files and I have decided to convert it to one single file and I just did it and I finished the operation so I just wanted to share the experience with you so I run this command uh, vdiskmanager.exe which is uh, which this exec executable is located in the uh, VMware workstation uh, installation folder in the C partition so I gave it these options minus R or dash R the uh, old disk name then minus T zero the new disk name so it's going to convert this old disk into this which has multiple uh, files into this new disk which is one single file so as you can see the operation has finished successfully and if you come here to the uh, virtual machine uh, folder so this is the new single file as you can see it has the size of 75 uh, almost 75 gigabytes and these are the old like uh, multiple files so one two three up to 33 files so I don't need these files anymore because all this data that is in these disks or virtu virtual disks is now in this single file so what I can do is remove all of these uh, files okay and paste them in this folder that I have called old disks okay so I just removed them and then rename this uh, new virtual disk and give it the same name as the old uh, disk which is CentOS 7 Oracle without uh, single in the end okay so now I'm going to try and start this vir virtual machine with you so if I do power on virtual machine let's see if it works it seems to be starting fine So now it should be using this uh, this new uh, virtual disk because I have uh, moved the old uh, disk to a new location so it cannot find it. But you have to give the new disk the same name as the old disks, disk otherwise the virtual machine is not going to be able to find it.
and as you can see the machine has started with no problem so now that means that I can come here and uh, delete delete this folder okay so I don't need it anymore I don't need all of these disks so I can do shift delete and that's it so this is it guys that's what I wanted to share with you in this video that's how you convert uh, a virtual disk that has multiple files into a virtual disk with one file thank you for watching